Prove that the center centroid of the rectangle is at the center. The formula for the centroids are the integral of x dA over the integral dA and the integral of y dA over the integral dA. This is de by definition. We need to pick a coordinate axis system. So let's let that be at the corner of the box so that that's my origin right there. My box is b times h in dimensions. I'm going to do it two different ways. The first thing I want to do is pick a differential element that's just dx dy. Now my centroid of this spot is at x and y for my differential element. Then we're going to come back through and we're going to have a differential element of rectangular slices. You need to remember that the x right here and the y are the coordinates of the centroid of your differential element. So in this case we do get in fact xy. Plugging that in, the integral goes from 0 to b and from 0 to h for x dy dx and my denominator is going to be dA. If you integrate the first integral you get 0 to b of xy from 0 to h dx and the integral from 0 to b of that. This gives you xh dx divided by essentially we're going to have bh on our, in our denominator. x squared h over 2 from 0 to b gives me b squared h over 2 divided by bh. Your h's cancel, one of your b's cancel, this is b over 2. My y bar here, if I'm going to do a two-step integral, looks the same. I get the integral from 0 to b of 1 half y squared from 0 to h divided by the area. If I do the second integral, I get 1 half h squared x from 0 to b, and that gives me 1 half h squared b on the top, bh on the bottom is h over 2. So the centroid is located at x equals b over 2, y equals h over 2, which is at the center. You can do a very similar thing if you don't want to do a double integral. If you take differential element for a as the vertical rectangle, this would be h times dx. Now I can do a single integral. The x bar is the integral from 0 to b of x times h dx divided by the integral from 0 to b of h dx. It gives you x squared over 2h from 0 to b and xh from 0 to b. If you integrate that, um, substitute those in rather, that's b squared over 2h divided by bh is b over 2. If you're going to do dA for the y bar component, it's a little bit easier to use a horizontal differential element where the height is dy and the width is b. Now if I plug that into my integral, I get 0 to h of y b dy. And on the bottom, I just have b dy. Evaluate the integrals, you get y squared over 2b from 0 to h, divided by yb from 0 to h. Gives you h squared b over 2 on the top, and hb on the bottom, which is h over 2. In either case, you've proved that the centroid of a rectangle is, in fact, in the middle.